Hello, and welcome to Starbound, with me, the most up one, okay, Mr. Sarat. Been doing a lot of mining, a lot of splunking. Got myself a nice, shiny new pick, made from diamonds. Okay, probably a waste of materials, but, eh, I wanted it, so I got it. And we could probably upgrade our copper pick as well. Let's just have a little look. What does that upgrade into? Uh, silver. For eight. Eight silver. Two hundred pixels. Let's do it. Let's do it. Because I go through so many picks when I do go mining. Supposedly diamonds can be used to... to repair. But I haven't been able to do that just yet. Doesn't seem to be working for me. Now what else have I done? Well, I've just gone and got myself a little bit of a little bit of raw alien meat because we were running low. Planted a few tomatoes just because I wanted to <laughs> and because we could, because we needed to really. So we've got a few bits and pieces we can put away here. Hmm. Oh, that's my diamond ore. Diamond ore, you actually do have to smelt that up. Oh, we got a few more... Oops, I want to put the axe in there. A few more plants. Unfortunately, this one we already have. That's the crystal table blueprint. Let's see if we can't use it, though. Just to see what happens. Uh, what else do we have? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, just your yeah, sapling seeds. Put away. Oh, there's the tomato. Egg shoot seed. Okay. Put you away as well. We've got a lot of plant fiber. Actually, let's make a few bandages because I have used up a good many of them. Bandages, where are you? Right there. Well, it'll only make 16, but no, oh well, it's good enough. It's good enough, it's all we're going to need, I'm sure. 35, <laughs> that's plenty. Uh, what's this one? This is for old equipment. Good, because we've got ourselves a rickety deflector. She can whack in there, because we've also got ourselves a poop arrow guard. <laughs> okay, well, let's stick with the, with the poop. Why not? What do we have in these chests down here? Nothing. And... Oh, well, bits and pieces. And in this bag. A lot of junk. That's what we've got. <laughs> Alright. Uh, do we have anything up here? We do. We got ourselves 350 pixels. That'll come in handy. I've started smelting up some of what we've collected. Might as well start smelting the rest of it. What else have I done? Well, I have gone and got myself a superior brain. Now, how do you get a superior brain? Well, it's exactly how you get the inferior brain. Basically, it's just pure luck. Pure luck getting a superior brain. It takes quite a while, it turns out, to get the superior brain using the brain extractor. What else? Let's just get the silver ore in there. Oh, we're going to have to get the iron in there too. Uh, yeah, it, you can get it from absolutely any mob in the game. Doesn't matter what level they are, they can drop a superior brain. Now, the higher the level, the more likely they are going to drop a superior brain though. I got my superior brain pretty deep. Pretty deep in my spawn world. Did I? Oh, yep, good. We have put a bit of fuel in. We're at 292. We've got 280 on us. We are going to need quite a bit more steel for what I want to try today. So let's get a little go on that. Now the robot crafting table needs a bit of steel. Needs that processor. 
I kinda do know how to get that processor. Let's get a little bit of steel going. We'll start with that. For that, we need to build ourselves this inactive robot. For the inactive robot. We need an artificial brain. Well, let's, let's give it a little crack, shall we? Let's give it a little go. Oh, I already got that. Uh, artificial brain! Yes, we can do it. We can do it. Nice. Alright, we can actually build the head now. Robotic head. Oh, we're all out of steel. Who'd have thought? It's a good thing we've got a lot of it. Well, capable of making a lot of it, I should say. Might have been a little bit too much, but that's okay. It's all good. We'll use it all up eventually. Okay, robot legs. Yeah, we're going to need a set of you. A chest. And arms. Is that all we need? Yep, need the arms. Fortunately, we also need a lot of pixels. It's okay, because we've got ourselves the refinery. Okay, um, the gold, gold converts all right. Get about 50, is it, or, yeah, 50 per piece. Alright, so how much did we need? We needed about 50 for the robot itself and about 400, I'm guessing, for the arms. Which means that was more than enough. Okay. Robot arms. Hopefully that's all that I needed. Inactive robot. Excellent. An inactive robot. I wonder what happens if it's switched on. Uh, uh, I have an idea. <laughs> we die. Yeah. We don't really have the best equipment for dealing with this, but armor-wise we're probably doing as good as we can. I wouldn't mind actually having a proper gun, to be honest, because I don't want to get too close to this thing. But, uh, that's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Let's just use this blueprint. This one here is a crystal bed blueprint. Oh, there we go. So now we know how to make a crystal bed. And the other one was for the crystal table. Blueprint already known. Yeah, there you go. Um... Oh, that's a full chest. Let's put it in here. Why not? Hmm, we could use bombs against him. Uh, no. No, that's, that's not fun. We've got all our iron. Good. Let's get some copper going. And then... And then we're gonna... Then we're going to go and die, most likely. Let's get some food. Very good. How's our copper? Oh, I wonder if you could shoot it with a brain extractor. It doesn't actually do as much damage as I'd like it to. When you get down a bit lower in the world, just on your spawn world, that is, it doesn't one-shot anymore. In fact, neither does this sword. Not the highest DPS weapon that I could build. It's just one that I'm familiar with, so that's why I went with it. Oh, there you go, straight away. 18 damage. Its damage per swing, though, is much lower, but it's much faster. I'm guessing that something like the Nibbler doesn't have the big around swing, it's just Probably a little jab. Carver? No. Brick on a stick. <laughs> I love the names. A tiny tomahawk. What else is there? Hmm. Skewer. 
20 DPS, a little bit faster. A little bit faster, but damage per swing is 12. My Vescua XL damage per swing is 12. Okay. Fair enough. Here's our copper. It's as good as it's going to get. We've got quite a lot of copper. A bit of iron. Still got a bit of steel. Surprisingly, we've got a bit of platinum as well. We're going to cook up the rest of these diamond ore. As you can read there, diamond ore can be used for smelting or repairs. Select the ore and right click pickaxe. Mm hmm. Um. Sure. Well, maybe. Maybe. Maybe I'm going to have to look into that a little bit more. But before we look into that, we're going home. I've got some tomato plants down here. I've got to look at. Uh, no. No, they don't seem to have done anything. Alright, what we want? That's my, my cave where I go down to to uh, mine. Oh, hello. Oh boy, I can't even take on one of these things. These ones down here, these ones absolutely destroy me. They move so fast. Oh, now you're poisoned. Now you're gone and done it. Well, you're dead. <laughs> Have a good time, both of you. Yeah, that's right, you're dead. So are you. Goodbye. Good knowing you. Alright. Alright. Turn around. Yep, there you go. We'll get some holiday spirit. Now. Oh, that was nice. These guys here, they don't fight me. Which means they are perfect for collecting meat from. Ooh. So everything else struggles when you try to shoot them. Okay, now... This here's a good enough spot. Most people, when they fight this thing, will have a lot... I mean, uh, I have no idea what's going to happen when we put this down. <laughs> Most people, when they put this down, will have a lot better technology. And I would recommend it too. But, uh, yeah, we're going to die. We're going to die. I should take it to planet surface before powering it up. Okay, um... Where, where do you think I am? Unless things have changed. It won't let me power it up. I don't have to take it to beta, do I? Okay. Ah! Whoa. Okay. All right. We're hiding. <laughs> it just needed more room, it seems. This here is actually the second boss. And as you can see, it does a lot of damage. Oh, I see. I got it stuck. Um. Let me out. So you can fight me. Oops. Oh. Now, it is a little bit glitchy. And it gets stuck on the smallest of things. Which is probably good for me.
because it moves fast and it jumps like crazy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But it it doesn't attack doesn't attack you just for going through it. Ow! Burn burn bad. Burn very bad. It's not as hard as what it used to be though. Oh, they're the last things I wanted to see. It used to be really hard. You couldn't get near it. Oops. Sorry, green mouse thingy. It would have destroyed me already for getting so close to it. Oh. Help! Oh, I'm hiding. <laughs> I'm hiding. No, we're going to use another bandage. Wow. Using body slam. I don't mind this weapon, actually. Ow! Oh, bash now. Ha <laughs> ha You can't double jump. You can jump. Oh, whew, jeez. You can jump pretty high, though. Oh! Whoa, nasty. Oh, you can almost get down here. Get back, get back. Oh! Okay, let's heal up. Oh! Oh my god, we got ourselves some of these things. We got some ads. <laughs> but we've also beaten him. Excellent. Let's go kill this thing for daring to fight me whilst I'm trying to take on an inactive robot. And let's kill you two because we can. Now these things here jump around way too much to shoot. Oh, I got him. <laughs> Okay, fair enough. Alright, so what we get out of that? We get ourselves the processor. Let's go use it. If we, oh, actually, we, don't, we probably don't have enough coins to use it, but let's go have a look at what we need to use it. The robotic crafting table. We're going to need a few more pixels, not many. We can do that with him. Hmm. Oh, we're getting a bit hungry. Quite hungry. Whack a bit of that in there. And now let's eat something. Nom nom nom. Yeah, a bit more. 80... another 60. Come on. You don't really get much for copper. I've got plenty of it. Was it 600 or 650? I can't recall. we got 650 now. And that... Robotic crafting table is enough. Excellent. This table has armed for precision. So we'll craft you up. There you are. Put you down right there. Well, let's have a little look at it. Thing's bloody freaky. Alright, so it's basically a crafting table, but you can craft a few more things with it, including this thing. The Star Map Upgrade Mark III. I can use this to upgrade my ship's engines, allowing flight into the gamma sector. Ooh, pixel compressor. I really wouldn't mind some of that. But for that we need titanium panels. Wow. Compressed pixels for storage. Let's have a look. What else can we make here? All the standard stuff. So, just learn how to yarn spinner. A lot of these things here are for when you build your base and decorating it, but with all the wipes the ships often wipe as well, so 
I really s should start picking all this stuff up, but... Cooking table, we got one of those. Chairs, hose, beds. Distress beacon. We could just about make another one of those if we really wanted to. Uh, I'll save that for... For the next wipe that doesn't wipe the character as well. Uh, iron anvil. Portable... Portable pixel printer. Oh. Oh. Unlocks the ability to craft small high-tech items on the fly. Oh. That looks interesting. Uses a bit of gold, a little bit of silver, a little bit of iron, and a little bit of pixels. Well, that doesn't use much at all. I might want to make one of those just for the fun of it. Uh, what else? We can make crystal chests. I didn't know that I could make them, but apparently I can. Crystal bed, crystal table. Very good. Alright, well, let's get a little bit more about pixels. I wouldn't mind getting that pixel compressor. I'm sure I've seen it somewhere else or something similar. Alright, but this portable pixel printer looks interesting. Let's have a little look at it. Okay, let's go over here and you can now print small high-tech items without a crafting table. New blueprints have been unlocked. So if we just go crafting maybe? Red toy block, sliding door, reinforced tech block. Hmm, okay. Nano wrap what? It's wounds together fast. Wow. Interesting. Nano starve? Stave? Stove. Get it right. Provides exceptional heat and a good place to cook. Nice. We just need a cheap light for that. Um, cheap light? Where do I get one of those? Uh, modern platform, high-tech block, steel block, light metal, a cheap light. Well, I guess that's where we get the cheap light from. Let's try one of you. No, not you, you. Nano stove. Ah, oh, we got one of those now. <laughs> I don't know if we need it, but we got one. Uh, let's try the bandage. We can make five. Because we're all out of pixels. Oh. Well, mm, okay. Oh. So it doesn't really do anything extra. It's a shame. <laughs> I wanted more. I mean, I have no idea about the bandages. I'm just guessing they do a lot better job. I suppose we can get rid of the cooking s the cooking the the stove here. Oops. Ooh, whoops. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was not what I meant to do. Well, the pickaxe is a little bit too good sometimes. Um Do I have that chest that I just dropped? Or that I just destroyed. Let's just put down a new one. And we'll put down the cooking thing of uh, who's he what's it? Let's just oh, oh. I thought I opened the chest, apparently I didn't. Let's fill it up. So all this junk. What was that? Wooden planks. Now we're keeping those. We may as well put a few more blocks in here. Definitely keeping the wood as well. Oh, that's all we can afford to fit in there. Alright, we do have another chest. Hmm. 
really have much room left. There we go. We'll whack you down there. Do that. We can put a few more things down. Ooh. Put most of it down. Alright, we can afford to go splunking again. Oh, excuse me. But if running nose is always okay, so we cook. And it's just a standard stove. Yeah, that's it. So basically it's it's a stove that also provides good warmth. And it looks fancy. <laughs> okay, alright. Well I suppose oh more stuff down here. Oh quite a lot more. Well wow. Yeah, yeah that, that filled us up a little bit. Hmm. Oh, we could have put down a large chest instead. More room. Oh, well, we didn't. But anyway, we have gotten quite a bit done today. We've also got quite a bit of fuel. Huh. Should we try going somewhere? Let's find a random place. Uh, we could try going somewhere like this. Looks interesting. Can't land. Uh, desert biome. Forest biome. All threat level one. Which you'd expect. Can't land there though. Hmm. Or should we try going to the beta sector? Uh, threat level two. Hmm. Ooh. Got herself a jungly place? No. 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 Hmm. Can't land. Wow, that's got a lot of planets. Can't land in the big gas giant. No surprises there. Hmm. Let's go here. Got a forest, snow, but not going snow. Moon, snow. Alright, so this is probably not a good one to go to. So let's go. Because I haven't been there yet. Let's have a little look see. At our character. It doesn't seem too stressed out about it all. Whoa. Okay, so we don't have much fuel left. That's a that's alright, because we actually do have a fair bit of coal lying around we could whack back in there if we needed to. But I'm hoping to get ourselves some new fancier fuel source. If we ever make it to this place. It's a lot of Sitting, watching, flashing by lights. Well, oh, there we go. I think we're here. We're here. Come on. Oh, oh, where is it? Where's our new planets? Here we go. Where did we end up going? We ended up going... Oh, we ended up going right here. Oh, this one here. Oh, we ended, up, we ended up going to the snow biome anyway. Oh, right. Let's have a quick little look at our planet, our new planet, before... Oh, we could walk home. It doesn't look too snowy. Oh, just as I say, it starts to snow. We'll have a look at our new planet. See if we can't die straight away. And, oh, I left all my tomato plants back at the other place. Oh well. What do we got here? Two-handed sword. And a free chest. Before we end the episode, I'm going to collect up this coal. 
my awesome silver pickaxe. Th this coal, I, I know that wasn't coal. <laughs> a bit of copper. Can never have too much coal. Now let's have a little look at this guy. Oh, there's two of them. Do I want to look at two of them? Oh! Oh, yeah. Alright. No, we owned him. Oh, wow. He owned us. Excellent. So, we're not overpowered. Yay! Like we were back at the other place. In fact, we're very much going to have to be watching what we do. Whoa, what a freaky looking spidery thing. Hey, I'm from Australia. We got bigger spiders than you. Well, they don't drop much though. But anyway, we're here, we've made it. A little bit of iron there, I don't care, it's tiny, I don't want it. We made it to a new place. Not the nicest of places. We'll stay in this nice little green area, even though it's snowing and there's some very strange inky water here. And more over here. Might set up a little temporary base. I really don't like the look of these purple one-eyed purple people eater thingies. Oh wow, there's a lot of them there. We're going back this way. But that's the episode anyway. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have, hit like, subscribe, leave a comment. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.